Today, One Audio's Monitor 80 Studio Open Back High Res Headphones. We're gonna take a look, check them out. These things are 89 bucks, but they're 30% off right now on Amazon, which is a steal for these headphones. Let's just take a look. You saw the quick unboxing in the beginning of the video. Now the packaging here, very nice, very clean, just like One Audio does. The Monitor 80 High Res Audio on the side. A little bit about these durable ear pads for comfort, velour ear pads, very comfortable, high sensitivity, low distortion, and stable connection. Again, wired headphones, so these are not going to have a lot of bells and whistles. These are for listening to music in the studio, for editing videos, whatever you want to use these for, you are going to need a DAC to get the best high-res audio out of these headphones. So the specs on here, monitor 80, 40 millimeter drivers on here, does give us the frequency range on the back. The two audio cables, which we will take a look at, there's a manual and they give us a carrying case. The 250 ohms of impedance on here, which is very good for a pair of $89 headphones. The sensitivity level, the distortion, the plug types, 3.5, and there is also a quarter inch stereo adapter on here, which I'm gonna show you actually right now. So we do get two cables, again, the quarter inch, and the 3.5 is the one cable, which is a very long cable, to be honest with you. They didn't skimp out on cables like a lot of other companies do. And then we have a very nice cable, 3.5 to 3.5 audio cable. And again, it's a good long cable, no skimping out on the cable. So I do appreciate that. Now the actual headphones on here, the open back style. You can see how good these look. The black and the silver look on here. Now these are plastic and they are very light and they are very comfortable. Not only because of how light they are, but because of these ear cups. Look at these velour ear cups on here. They are wide, so they will just about fit anybody's ears unless you have giant ears. These are gonna cover your ears. These are very comfortable. They do get a little sweaty if you wear these for an extended period of time, but I haven't really had any issues. The clamping force on here is mild. It's not weak, it's not strong, it's kind of in the middle. I didn't have any issues with the clamping force on here. They do fold, they do swivel, and these are a very comfortable pair. Now there is some branding here on each ear cup. You can see high definition drivers, 250 ohms, so you are going to need a DAC to run these to get a more stable, solid, and powerful sound out of these headphones and the power of music, the Monitor 80s. Very, very comfortable. And of course, they do slide. And the band up top, the band has some branding on it, the One Audio brand, very comfortable and very nice. Now, let's just throw these on. You can take a look at, well, how they look. All right, so the look of these headphones, very nice, very clean looking headphones, and of course, no headphones really fit in my head because I have an oval shaped head. But again, these are super comfortable, very lightweight, and the ear cups, I love the velour ear cups. Very nice. Now, let's talk about the sound quality on these headphones. Look, studio headphones, open back headphones. Number one, you are going to have a bit of sound leakage. It's not too bad, but there is some sound leakage on these headphones if you are wearing these out and about. These are studio headphones meant to be worn at home. I mean, you can wear these out if you want. You will hear your outside surroundings, and in turn, those people will hear your music as well. So just keep that in mind. Now, the sound quality. These are meant to be worn and listened to with a portable DAC. If you are using these on your phone to give you that boost, to give you a little bit more power, to give you a little bit better audio quality, or you are going to want to plug these in. Well, you're not going to want to. You should plug these in to an amplifier or a DAC. I use the iFi Zen DAC at home, and I do have the Periodic Audio Rhodium portable DAC, which is great to use with your phone to get the best audio quality. You can get high-res certified audio, lossless audio, whatever I am listening to at the time. If I'm on my phone, I am going to use this to give me that extra boost. And if I'm at home, I'm, you know, editing videos or whatever, I am using the i5 Zen DAC. And I'll leave all of the links below so you guys can check those out. Now, the sound quality, again, not bangers. If you're a bass head, this is not the pair of headphones for you, but there is some good sounding bass. It's clean, it's crisp, it hits, it's sharp, and it sounds really good. The mids on here are clean, very nice. Instrument separation is there. You're gonna be able to pick it apart. And as far as the highs goes, Depending on what amp you have and what genre of music you are listening to, every now and then it can get a little too bright, but you can dial that back on your amp 
if you have to and get it to just sound really nice, crispy, and clean. These things sound great for the price, guys, especially at the $89 price point and 30% off right now. These are a steal. The Comfort, we do get some accessories, the extra long cables. I think they did a really good job here with the monitor 80s and just giving us a budget pair of studio headphones. These things are a steal at this price right now. But that's it guys, just a quick video, check it out. One Audio's Monitor 80 Studio Open Back High Res Certified Headphones. I'll drop all the links. If you're new to the channel guys, hit that like, give me a sub, ring that bell, stay up to date every time I drop a video. Stay safe, peace.